Seats don't look bad to me. Yeah. Your Honor. But just a second. Sorry. Does it sound as if you're losing? Yeah. Why would you yeah. want to say no. anything to me? I just you... want to show you some more boat seats like that. Just, just, just a second. Yeah. I don't care. And I'm looking at the seat. Yeah. He's going to use those yeah. seats on the boat. Yes. And he may not be able to use them for five years. Maybe he'll only be able to use them for three years or two years. And then if he wants to have them redone, he'll take them to somebody else. Well, and Certainly work was done on yeah. those. And also um, the job in title, like I'd said, he was supposed to put everything back together. He called me whenever he was done. Your stuff's done. And everything was sitting in the floor of his shop. And I said, original agreement was you were supposed to put it back in my boat. He said, well, I'm not going to be able to do that. Did you put it all back? No. I don't know where? how. I didn't take it apart. So I don't know how to put it back Just together. Just a second. So where is the boat? My boat is sitting in my yard stripped and all of the upholstery is stuffed in any spot I can find it. Every upholstery piece. I've got some stuffed in my SUV, some stuffed in my carport. I don't know how he took it apart because I wasn't there. There's several pieces that have to be reassembled. He sent me boxes of hinges and screws. He took my speakers off. I've got cut wires. Well, that's, well, that's a problem. Now you have a problem. Now I may let you speak, Mr. Adams. Why didn't you put the boat back? I have a back issue and I told him that I wouldn't be able to do it myself. If he wanted to help me to do it, I'd be more than happy to help him do it. No, 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 no. That doesn't wash with me. One of these two people doesn't yeah. have back issues. Neither one was working the day he picked it up. Just a second. He brought the boat in in February. This was the end of August. He had stalled it all this time to get the other parts so I could put the boat seats together. He made new wood for all the seats. Just a second, who did? He did. Here's the picture. Just a second. So is what he's telling me that the reason that the boat was there from February to August, at least mm -hmm. part of the reason, that he couldn't use the existing seats on the boat and that you ordered new seats, the wood, for the boat? I uh, fabricated them myself because he wanted to charge just, me extra just. money because the wood was rotten. And he said, bring, <laughs> bring, bring more money, this wood's rotten. I said, instead of giving you more money, just a second. I'll just redo the wood myself. That's fine. So the wood was rotten yes. for the seats. Several of them. I'm going to take a look at his pictures. And here's all the text messages with it. To the left of that one picture is the rotted wood sitting in a chair. He acknowledges that the wood was yes. rotten. And, he's... and there were several pieces Shh. that were found. What were you receiving workman's comp for? Back injury. I received on the job. So how'd you make these new seats? A friend. A friend did all the a cutting. Friend did yes. all the, a friend he did all the cutting. I did the coating with the polyurethane myself. But the very last pieces, I did myself. Which those last pieces I cut five months after he had my boat. He had just taken them off the boat. You're, you're, so he's still pulling pieces off the boat that need, be, need to be reupholstered. Five I'm reading after the he has email, it. sir. Okay. That you were waiting for your check. Okay. Do you understand? Yes. And that was the delay. Yep. You were waiting for the check. That was a two week delay out of five <laughs> months. Now, you have a counterclaim. Yes, ma'am. Your counterclaim is for defamation, actually. I've lost so, a lot of money. For well, me. I don't know that whether you have or not. You want to show me how he's defamed you and in what form that defamation. I'd like to see this. What are you showing me? The one on the left is where a gentleman came in the same day he picked his boat seats up and filled out the invoice to have his done, same amount of seats. And after he went out front, he never showed back up to get it done. I don't know where that, <laughs> that never even took place. Okay. Mr. Burnhill, I suggest you put your boat back together again. Do you understand? You're not getting $5,000. You're not even getting your $2,200 back from him. Your seats were reupholstered. That's what you brought them in for. Now, there was the delay. The delay in getting the boat back, based upon the emails that I read, was as much your fault as his. Um, you didn't have the cash. You were waiting for a workman's comp check, so you needed money. That's what it all says here. And you sort of strung him along. You went to the shop the day before you went and brought him money. And there was there's no animus here, by the way, in these last emails in August. Okay, but as far as the storage of my boat get, and my floor but, being you rotted get what out. You, you get what you pay for. The seats were rotted out before you brought them in. That's not the floor, though. The I had the floor seats, redone the year before. The I've got receipts from that. That's a new floor. I just had that floor redone the year before. And if he would have stored it properly, it would not have, that wouldn't have happened. You went and examined the boat. You were there the day before you went and paid for the boat. You said absolutely nothing about that in your emails to him. Absolutely nothing. Your case is dismissed. So is your counterclaim. You have no cause of action. You understand that. We're done.